My position is actually pretty terrible here. Probably the worst position I've had in a while. Take and take, and if it takes, I take, if it takes, 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 we need two. Come on! Oh my god! That is why now you resign sometimes. Oh, voila. I didn't even have to make any moves. <laughs> Just past the 18 hour mark of the average XQC. XQC is insane. Oh, who's this? He's not an FM. Is this another guy who has, he says Grandmaster, but he's an FM. Okay, it's it's aspirational, but that doesn't mean it's going to become true. Have I played Levy? Not in the speed run, no. I think I actually, I played Levy once in Title Tuesday, and I think we played like one match sometime back of like 10 games, but that's it. Like we just haven't played. Yeah, it's kind of wild actually. I'm just barely 11. Can you guys believe there's someone who's 22,000, 2100 in chat? Yeah. No, Jimmy, Jimmy, I mean, I hope Candy gets to IM, but I got to be honest, I feel like for Candy too, the, the, the time is ebbing. It's ebbing. His chances are, are fading a little bit. Um, I mean, I, I, ho I hope he can get there, but I'm, I'm not very optimistic, to be honest. Like, so we'll see. What do I want to do here exactly? I don't really want to go C4. So how do I do this? I also don't want to take, I guess I don't want to play C4 either, but whatever. I mean, I guess we'll go A3 here. But I think of Levy's claim, we're not talking about Levy right now, you guys. I'm really getting sick of it. I'm getting really sick. Everyone's asked this like 20 times a day and it's really starting to get on my nerves. Like every everybody's played their role and that's that, okay? Enough, enough with the Levy question, seriously. Everyone's played their role. Everyone's done things, and that's that. No one person, no one group. Like, I mean, chess.com's not entirely responsible. Then again, neither is Fide. Neither is Levy solely responsible. Neither am I solely responsible. Like, it's just a mix of many things happening. Uh, I can't resist sacking, so I'm going to sack. I mean, I love these knights, but I got to sack. Take a pawn. Oh, a bishop e3 or something. It's got knight f3, which, of course... I guess I'll go here and B4 or something. So was COVID. I mean, a, a, there are like many different reasons. No, no one person is responsible. Antonio, I mean, Antonio, yeah, like everybody's done something. The only sad thing I would say is in regards to like Antonio. So Antonio is not getting the, uh, he's not getting the big boost. Like there are, the, there are three YouTube channels that are getting these, ma getting a massive boost right now. Like there's my channel, there's Levy's channel, and there's the chess.com channel. But it doesn't seem like that boost on YouTube, at least, is transferring over to other channels. Levy's been acting like Gary Chess. I don't want to hear it, you guys. I, I just don't want to hear it, okay? Thank you so much to Chris Nothel for the Prime and G-Man for the Prime. Thank you to G-Man Garrett Adelstein for the Prime. Thank you so much. Okay, I guess I'll go here. I mean, I've got all these pawns. I've got, like, Connect 5. Okay, F4 is logical. I guess I'll go... I'm gonna go to a7 because this way I also cover the queening square. So I've got a right triangle, of course, 90 degrees, obviously. Thank you so DS Litz for the prime. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Okay, so he goes f5. If I go b3, f6, he's trying to get the lolly. The lolly is a little bit scary, actually, here. If I go c3, f6, c2, queen g5 is still a problem. Okay, I'm gonna take just to dodge any lollies with f6 and queen g5 and queen h6. I just, I don't want, I don't want it. Wow, he trades. I mean. Am I really not fast enough here? Like, I'm going to go B3. I mean, I assume the pawns are good enough, but maybe they aren't. Oh, I can't play Rook D8, which is my... Rook D8 is my initial idea, but he has a four with Knight C6. He goes back. I mean, I get another pawn here in the center. Like, I have three pawns for the, uh, for the Knight, which is a lot. Rook F4 is a good move, but I can still guard. Hard to judge. I think there's a Britney Spurs for the prime. Thank you so much. Now I'm just going to play, I guess, H6. I, I can play any move here, but it, this is one of them. Um, I'll drop back. I don't even know what the best move is. Go here, guard everything. I mean, these pawns are so scary. I don't know how black, white's supposed to stop them exactly. 
Okay, so I have B2. I think I'm just going to go B2 because I have C3, so he can't block. Go here and Rook D3. Oh, no, I actually blunder. Shoot. I, I mean, I guess I have Rook D1, maybe. I mean, these pawns are still very tricky to stop. In fact, how does white stop them? Maybe he can't stop them. Rook B1's the only move. There we go. Another win. Next game. What are we up to? We're getting pretty close, right? Pretty, pretty close. Getting, getting close. Go, next game. I think we need one more, right? One more game to get there? Or no, I'm 2888, so we need two more. I think there's an elect gorilla for the prime. I think there's an elect gorilla. Okay, uh, let's play H4. Okay, we're playing Elham, the Twitch Elham man. Of course, he's here to troll, obviously. What am I eating? I got some sandwiches, so I'll eat them a little bit later. Play C3, D4, I guess. D5, logical. I'll just play E3. Maybe Bishop B5. Probably he'll trade. He can also go E4. I have Knight D2, though. Keep it simple here. By the way, joking aside, big shout to Alham, of course. He played a recent tournament in, um, played a recent tournament, I think, in, uh, Sweden or somewhere, and he did, he did very well. He ended up, he kind of choked away a game right at the end, but, uh, he, he had a great result overall. So, big shout out to Alham, joking aside. Let's go here in Knight C3. Oh, Rilton Cup? Ah, okay. Rilton Cup, yeah. My position is actually pretty terrible here. Probably the worst position I've had in a while. I'll just take. I have queen a4. Not the dream, but it's maybe okay. Does he have I am norms? I don't... Elham is an I am, actually. He is an I am. Yeah, I was about to say, like, he is... He's legitimately a good player. Go here, go after this pawn. Yeah, what am actually what am I doing here? I gotta get my king out of the center of the board here. The eight. Go here. Wait a second. If I take Is there some trick that I'm missing here? There's some like queen g4 or something, right? Oh uh, wait, I mean I guess I pre-move this save pre-move. There's some trick here. I think there's some queen g4 thing that I'm missing or something, but I maybe I'm wrong. Oh, no, I can just... Oh, no, I can't castle through check. What am I... I can also sack... Wait, wait, but I can also sack on h5. At first, I thought I could castle, but that's an illegal move. There's a queen. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's bad. Okay, so if I take, take, take... I guess I'll take and take. That's ridiculous. Wesley So has entered the chat. Oh, I don't see Wesley. Is Wesley here? Or did Wesley castle illegally in a game? What do you mean? Maybe Wesley castle illegally? I don't know. Take the pawn, of course. Because check, I can run the king out. B5? I can obviously take, but... Rook G5 is mildly scary. Somehow I've got to get my king out here. Maybe d5 is a move, actually. Ah, whatever. Let's just take. And hopefully I'm not blundering this whole game. I mean, I'm so close to 2900 now. Like, so close. It would be a tragedy to throw it away. But that's not the... That's not the spice, I don't think. Because now I, now I think my king, I can go, like, rookie one. I have queen f5 check. That's not the spice. He missed it. I think... I, I don't know if I'm winning, but... I don't think I'm probably losing anymore. I think there's a Lego black for the prime, they have Asher for the prime, and Spindly for the prime. Right, but now I can go G4 too. So now I have Queen F5 check, which is a big problem as well. Yeah, he 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 missed he he messed this up. Completely messed this up. So I, I have two connected juicers, and I mean okay, so if I take check king. 
I don't know. I if I take take King C1, Queen E3, Bishop D2. I mean, I just I don't believe you. I just don't believe this dude. I think he's full of Bologna here. I just don't believe him because I can run the king up and block with everything with the queen, etc. Oh, if I go here, checking. <sighs> Again, I still think he's full of Bologna. I just don't believe him. I go here and block. Yeah, he's full of Bologna. Thank you so much to Lempec for the four months. Appreciate it. Now I just block. Oh, he also had Queen B2, which was kind of interesting. But now it's, this is just a matter of technique. Uh, Queen B7 is no good. Queen C4, maybe. Hit the rook, I can go d5, b4. I think I just go d5 and b4 and just lock it all up. Oh, do I have queen c8 also? Yes, I do. Checks, logical. Yeah, it should just be winning. Okay, just eat the pawn with check, and that's all she wrote. What am I doing? Oh, let's go here. I just start pushing the pawn, and I push all the pawns. Okay, we got the dub. There we go. Thank you so much to Hikaru Fanboy for the prime. Thank you so much to Hikaru Fanboy. Appreciate it. All right, let's keep going. How do Queen see it works? He takes the queen. I take his queen. That's how it works. All right, let's go. One more. One more for 2,900. Come on, let's go. One more. Okay, there we go. Let's play A5. Play a Karo Khan. Uh, this probably does... Very poorly, but still reasonable, it looks like. Um, I guess I'll just play e6. I mean, I can always trade. I can always also always play a4. So let's go knight f6 here. Bishop g5, interesting. If I play h6, I'm kind of curious what's going on here. He's going to take... I'm going to take with a pawn to cover knight e5. Play bishop b4. I mean, I guess just bishop e7 seems reasonable. We play like h3, we trade... Thank you so much to High Power for the 8th. Thank you Daddy D for the Prime and Matt Huizinga for the Prime. Thank you so much, Matt Huizinga. Not disrespecting Elham. Oh, I'm not being disrespectful enough. Okay, we're playing this guy, this little kid. He's an FM. I mean, he tries. He's, he's, he's somewhat decent at chess, but he still can't compare to me. Um, let's go King F8 here. Maybe like Knight A6, Knight B4. Again, not super worried. We'll go here, Knight B6. I'm just going to outskill him. I mean, he, he, he might have played a lot online, but... He's still like half my age, so I, I just don't believe that he can really be all that good. Let's go knight b6 here. Thank you so much to I chip it for the prime. B sets on. I'm gonna play a4 here, fix the weakness, and then bishop d6, of course. Well, you guys wanted me to be more disrespectful, so I'm gonna be more disrespectful. It's hard though, because he, he is legitimately a good player. He's a player who's played a lot online, he is improving. I don't like that though. If I go f5, is he really sacking? I also no no, I, I mean. Yeah, I mean, whatever. I take and go Queen G5. This is total Bologna as well. You don't have to go back. And I mean, I actually think I'm doing quite well here. It's weird. It takes, I just take the juicer. I mean, I could even just take the rook probably, but we'll see. I think there's a Chewy Bar for the Prime Thing. A Chewy Bar. Elham up 25 18. Yeah, Elham is. Uh, he's, he played really well in that t recent tournament in, uh, in Sweden, so. Blonde walks into a bar and asks for a double entendre, so the bar barman gives her one. What? Is that some joke that I'm missing? What is this? I mean, this should be good for me if I play this precisely. It's an interesting idea by LM. So he's basically giving me 
He's giving me two rooks and a bishop for the queen. I don't really believe this is enough, but we'll see. We'll go here in rook g5, maybe. Also, rook g6. I don't think this is enough for him. The wizard melon just resubbed for 12 months. 12 months of disrespect. Go here. I mean, I can play rook f6. I also have knight c4. I mean, this doesn't look right, objectively. Yay! Erdbert just took $5 out of Bezos's pocket. Is b3. Hmm. Obviously trade, but again, at this point in the game, the only thing that actually matters here is that I don't make some huge blunder. YB Tech just subscribed. B3. I mean, I can obviously take. I guess I'll just take. Why not? It should be pretty cleanly winning for me. Let's go here. Bishop E1's a big threat. No, I don't know why I did that. That was a bad move. Got to cover the square, okay. Let's go here. Don't really care if he takes the pawn. I mean, I have all the squares covered here. Go here, attack the knight. How do I do this? I need to reroute my knight. I guess I'll go here in 97 and knight at five. Still not trivial to win. So I'll go here, of course, to guard the pawn. Oh, I had rook c2, which was obviously very strong. I guess I'll go here. Okay, drop back. Probably I go rook f5 somewhere in here soon. Go here, attack the knight. I go here now there's no knight of four now i have bishop e1 and now the house i think starts to collapse completely he's gonna have to start pushing pushing p and then once i get rook c2 and rook e6 i think this is basically just lost go here attack the knight this should be ggs i think we're about to cross 29 i take check and mate there we go thank you to ergbert for the 16 they need a wizard melon they need a yb1k as well for the win all right, you guys, we get a big dub there. We push our rating over 2,900, which is a very important mark. We're now like 95 points away from the super critical 3,000 level.